hits third, Robbie Reed. Shane Lewis and Sean Deering rounding out the top six. Well, Keith Pratt and Dave Wheatholder to lead them to the green. Well, it's going to be Pratt leading them down the back stretch. Here comes Dave Wheatholder. Big run in the turns three and four. Pratt working the bottom of the speedway. Wheatholder getting it cranked up around the top. Side by side of the flag stand, followed by DeLon J and Michael Long. Wheatholder and Pratt once again, even into turn number three. Pratt in the middle of the speedway. It's going to be Dave Wheatholder leading lap number two. Here comes DeLon J around the bottom of the speedway, challenging Wheatholder for the lead. Pratt and Long, followed by Deering, Spiegel, and Reed. It's going to be the 35 of DeLon J leading lap number three. Michael Long getting it cranked up around the top of the speedway. Works around Pratt through turns three and four. DeLong J, Weedholder, Long, and Pratt, Spiegel, Deering, and Reed. And we've got caution, turn four. Caution, turn four. Well, Stephen DeLong J sets the pace, looking for that green flag to fly. Well, DeLong J continues to work at the bottom of the speedway. Now, Michael Long up to challenge Wheat Holder for the number two spot. Spiegel settles into the fourth spot, followed by Pratt, Reed, and Deering. Now Michael Long climbs the banking down in turns three and four. Weed Holder continuing to work the cushion through turns three and four. Stephen DeLong J four car length advantage here at lap number seven. Michael Long continuing to search all over the speedway. Meanwhile, the seven of Spiegel right there on the back bumper. Well, Wheat Holder keeping it close with DeLonge, but DeLonge two car length advantage here in lap number nine. Wheat holder, yellow flag, yellow flag. Trouble in turn number two, the 733 of Havermail around turn two. Modified title will bring them back to the green. Well, Craig Spiegel dropping to the bottom of the speedway through turns three and four, up to challenge Michael Long for the third spot. Well, DeLon J getting it going here on the restart out to about 10 car lengths over Wheat Holder into turn number three. And caution, turn four, turn four. It's the 43 of Baker, Jeremy Baker, around turn four, caution flag in here. Back to the green flag action this time, turn number four. Once again, Stephen DeLonge setting the pace.
halfway there, Craig Spiegel and Wheat Holder nearly side by side for the runner up spot. Michael Long back alongside Spiegel battling hard for that third spot. Everybody still chasing that 35 of Delonge. Wheat Holder and Michael Long continuing to work the cushion down in turn number four. And caution on the speedway once again. The 733 of Haver Well, once again, back at it here. 17 laps complete, eight laps to go. Three car battle for the number two spot. Trouble turn four. One more time, DeLong J will lead the field back to the green. It's going to be Delonge, Long, Wheat Holder, and Spiegel, followed by Robbie Reed and Sean Deering, your top six. Well, Delonge quickly out to a 10 car length advantage over the field into turn number three. And big trouble off turn four. Russ Schoonover around collects the 43 of Jeremy Baker. Well, the 43 of Baker heavily damaged. Well, the long J once again leading the charge to the flag. Wheat Holder moves up the uh, banking. He and Long race wheel to wheel for that second spot. Now three wide battle for the number two spot. Wheat Holder's got it into turn number three. Robbie Reed now working inside of Michael Long for the number three spot. But DeLonge distancing himself from the rest of the field. Well, Keith Pratt draws to the read back bumper, white flag in the air for DeLonge. And DeLong J out to nearly a straightaway advantage down the backstretch. Checker flag in the air. It's going to be Stephen DeLong J, Dave Weedholder, Michael Long, Robbie Reed, Keith Pratt.
sneak peek down here with Steven Delange. Steven, congratulations on your midseason championship win tonight. You come in the point leader. You have a pretty big point lead. You come out, you lead the race flag to flag tonight, and you win it. How do you feel? Oh, man, I, I feel like I needed that one for some reason. Uh, I've just been struggling here a little bit lately. Ain't, ain't got... Uh, you know, ain't been winning like like I would like to, and uh, man, it just feels good to come out and get a win. Um, me and my dad kind of thought the the track would go to the bottom here by the time our feature come around, and we set her up for the bottom. And I tell you what, it, it was good there, so we did it right. All right, Stephen Delange, congratulations on your midseason championship win tonight. We're gonna sneak over here and get a word with Dave Weeholder. Dave Weeholder, your second finisher tonight. Dave, congratulations on your second place. It's not a win, but hey, it's midseason and you'll take it, right? Yeah, I'll take what you can get. You know, it's just, it's tough. You know, it's, I mean, Steven's got a good car and works pretty good around the bottom. And every time I get a momentum going on the high side, we had a caution. But uh, good run, Steven, and uh, good job, Michael. And hopefully we'll be back here next week with a win. So. All right, there we have it. Dave Weeholder, always the good sport that he is. Congratulations on your second place finish.